Hello there. Welcome back to Selenium Training. In this tutorial, we will cover how we can maximize the window while invoking a browser. There are many methods through which we can achieve this and in this video, we are going to see some of them. The easiest one of them will be described in this video. So let us create a simple Java project and add the jar files. Let me name it maximize. Don't create. All right, one project has been created. Now let us add a class. Window maximize. All right. So before going further, we need to insert the first steps that is the path of the chrome driver exe if you don't know about them please refer to the back videos i have clearly explained how you can do this right now i am going to copy that simply all right let me now add the jar files if you don't know about these jar files please refer to the previous videos i have clearly explained there how you can add the jar files Yes, here we go. All right, hover our mouse to Chrome driver and import the packages. Same with the web driver. All right, so we want to achieve a window maximization. First, let us go to a window. Let me go to Flipkart this time. driver dot get flip card all right so let me show you first if we uh, how it normally opens a window if we do not mention any maximization tricks here so this is the basic size of the window that it opens automatically so let me close this so this is the first method let me show you first method it is simple driver dot manage dot window dot maximize this is one way let us run the script Browser invoked. All right. This is a simple one. Suppose you want you don't have the requirements. Suppose in your real time project you have to set a specific size. You don't like uh, need to completely maximize the screen. We can also do that with the help of dimensions method. Create a object of the dimensions. And give the coordinates x and y suppose I give 100 and I give 700 all right now let us driver dot manage dot window already dot the method we are going to use is set size all right and the object is D all right let us import the packages for dimensions you have to you import this dimensions all right it has been imported now let me use this timer for here so that you can easily check it out as two second timer add throws declaration let me save the script and execute the script you see the browser has been set to a specific size. Now, this time I want to close the browser also. All right. And which 
I'll change the values. Let's put it 800 and 1000. Add a sleep timer so you can see how long it takes to close the browser. Now this this is a different size this time. The browser will be closed. All right. Suppose you don't want to use this method also. All right. This was the second method. We can use another method that's called a Chrome options. Basically, Chrome option is a class in uh, for Google uh, for Google browser particularly, which adds the functionality of the script. Suppose you want to run your test in incognito mode, you can use uh, Chrome options for that. Suppose you want to run your script in a headless mode in a headless browser, you can use Chrome options for that. In the next lectures, I'll be showing you the Chrome options briefly. But right now, I'll be showing how you can achieve. Uh, maximizing the window with the help of Chrome options. First, let us create the object of Chrome options class. All right. Let me import the packages. Okay. Now I'll pass this argument this object in as argument here now we can uh, play around this object options dot add argument all right here we have to just write start maximized all right let me and this is the third method let me write it here third method let me execute the script all right all right guys you see our window has been maximized I hope guys you found this video helpful if you do then please share among people who want to learn automation from scratch you can also mention any different methods you are using in the comment section learning is the key for everyone thank you guys and stay tuned for more